All right, I haven't recorded on the main channel in a while, but since the whole Jay-Z thing uh, is being talked about, I might as well get in on it to get some views, if that. But anyway, so with this whole Jay-Z thing, with him of going up to the NFL, you know, people saying he's selling out, this and that, listen, at the end of the day, people have to realize that these celebrities are gonna do what's best for business, all right? That's what people don't understand, all right? When money talks, secrets walk, all right? Remember that. And this is and this is what I'm talking about here, all right? Because this is multi-layered. The kneeling and then Jay-Z going up there, there's a whole lot of different components to it. But at the end of the day, all right, if you get paid enough, you will work with the enemy, regardless of what happens, all right? And then my thing is also this is, as well, is that if Jay-Z was going up there accepting a paycheck from the NFL and he's a billionaire, my thing is this, is that it's already bad enough that black people don't own nothing now. Instead of going up there receiving a payday, why not try and start your own league? I mean, heck, Vince McMahon is starting the XFL, like somebody want to see that. So why not, why, why don't Jay-Z just start the JFL or whatever name you want to call it, you know? Instead of sitting there, you know, moaning and groaning, which you have a right to do, you know, you have, everyone has a right to complain. If Jay-Z's a supposed billionaire, instead of going up there to cash in, why not meet up with Colin and all these other people and try and, and try and create your own league? Try and do something for yourself. Take all those players that, that, uh, that that's, for, that's in the NFL field and not being treated right and, and take them and bring them in your black capital and create your own league. Sure, it's gonna be work, all right? But at the end of the day, that all, all you're doing is proving that you can do it by yourself if you're this supposed billionaire. And then also, my thing is too, is that, is that since Kaepernick got paid, all right, it took a while for a response to come out because now, seeing as how he done got paid, it took what, almost a day and a half for a response? And then why is his girlfriend always speaking for him? And why not, that, that, that's my situation. Why is she always speaking for him? Sure, you know, your significant other is always going to try and defend you, this and that. But at the end of the day and whatnot, you have to be a man and come out at a certain point in time and issue your own statement. So for me, this whole thing is nonsense anyway, because me, I really don't watch football anyway. You know, I've never been a sports fan like that like a big sports fan like that so my thing is this at the end of the day if people can't see the forest from the trees then i don't know what to tell you and at the end of the day also too just come up with your own league and all of this would have been resolved all of this would have been done all right you can you know how you really stick it to the nfl you compete against them all right but at the end of the day it is what it is i kept the video short i wasn't going in like all these other people